Ooh, do you know what I'm thinking? What if the father happened to be a Knologia? If you ain't know, now you know, huh? Let me shoot some real quick. Follow me. Hi everyone, I'm going to react to Fairy Tale, the final season, episode uh, 313, Dragon Seed. And last episode, Sting fought against the arcade and apparently he's defeated. I'm still not sure about that because I feel like that battle was way too easy. And then you have Natsu just getting worse, getting colder and closer to death. And then um, Perushka or whatever her name is asked Lucy to give him body heat. And then you have um, Erza. Irene telling Elsa, Elsa that um, she's her mother and that she's the queen of the former queen of the dragons. I'm like, oh, that was such a shocker to me. Uh, there are so many shockers this season. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, I think that's basically what happened. And now uh, let's start this episode. Does that mean she was a dragon? Kingdom of Dragon Off. Oh, Bersilion. Uh, that's uh, Irene's last name. It's kind of nice to see a city of dragons and humans. Was that a statue of her and Bersilion or whatever? Ishgar. What was Ishgar again? Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, I didn't even think about that. Reinforcement or enchantment? Okay. That's what she used on those soldiers and turned them into mindless, whatever, berserkers. Is that the predecessor? So she's the one that came up with the dragon slayer thing. Wow. Like jail. Rogan sting. And that's who's somewhere over there. Oh. oh, was Lexus also a dragon slayer? Oh, God, I don't quite remember that. Ah, oh, buddy heat.
Aknologia. We finally see him after how many episodes of not seeing him? I guess that Irene spell that split the kingdom did his trick. Is that a little Elsa? Okay, my dear. <laughs> oh, I just realized that Natsu is cold and then it's um, snowing in his mind or whatever. father what do you mean who cares i know the mother i want to know the father too shoot i know there are single mothers out there <laughs> bro everybody has a mother and father in the world i just want to know who her father is that's all Okay. Yes, see? The father. Ooh, do you know what I'm thinking? What if the father happened to be a Knologia? Doesn't he kind of look like him? Like if you see the, if he grows the long hair. Oh, See, war doesn't do anything for you, man. It's just death everywhere. Okay. But it would have been kind of cool, though. I gave birth. Oh, he's turning into a monster. Oh, but, but a dragon. Oh, so that's where the hideous thing came in. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Now it makes sense. Oh, she's in prison just like Elsa was. How do you go from wanting to keep your baby safe to now just fighting her like nothing? Whoa. Oh, okay. <laughs> you were the one that made her a threat. She wasn't going to do anything to you guys. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that where Zeref is gonna come in and be her savior? You know, I can never hate Zeref.
Wow. What is she gonna do? What the heck? So are you telling me that uh, if Elsa dies, she's gonna die too? Or the other way around? What the freak? Ah, oh, thank gosh. Cause she found fairy tale. Yes. Have we seen that outfit before? I don't know, but she just was so good. Any episode there's no action in it is a waste of episode. Are you freaking kidding me? What the heck is wrong with you? So, what's up with story? We do not, we do not see not one combo fight. <laughs> what will we see a fight? Girl, I want to see a fight. You saw a fight yesterday, but yesterday, the last episode. <sighs> Yo. What is trash? Well, I was glad for this episode because we saw that backstory with Elsa's Irene. Bro, making noise with your <laughs> nothing. I don't know if it's your shoes or whatever, but it's making some kind of noise. Well, this episode first let's take care of Natsu. Natsu, there's nothing really that happened with Natsu and his his mind. He just saw Wendy and uh, Gajil, I think, and we still don't know why he's dying, so there's that. And they showed um, Lucy and uh, Happy giving him hit, and that's basically what happened with Natsu. Now, with Irene and Erza, to find out that Irene is the one that created the Dragon Slayer magic thing was like another shocker that I didn't see coming. And then from there we found out that uh, um, that once we turn into a dragon slayer uh, some things happen like you could it might not go well with you and you're gonna um, turn into a berserker like the dragon and the human mixing doesn't go well you turn into a, a berserker or you have the vertigo that our dragon slayers have like Natsu and um, Gajil. Does Gajil have that? I'm pretty sure he does too. Like with motion sickness and all that kind of stuff. So that was cool to find out why that happened. And then there's the thing with the dragon seed where you turn a seed grows in you until you turn into a dragon and that's what happened to Irene. And she cast a spell on Elsa so she doesn't give birth while she was in prison by the husband like <sighs> and then the, he came with the sword and was about to split her open like what the heck and that's why she, she just, like, was so protective over the baby that she turned into a dragon right then and there and just crushed him and he died and the way that she was so protective at first and then after figuring out that she's gonna be like a dragon forever you know that i feel like that did something to her mind where she just went crazy just didn't care about elsa anymore which is weird and i love that when we were introduced to irene at first there was the instance where she turned the king's 
um, daughter, the princess, into a mouse. And then she asked the king if she would still love her daughter. And then there's the part where she was firing, fighting Mira Jane. And um, uh, she was like, she was going to turn her ugly and whatever. So I was wondering, like, where is that coming from? Like, her turning people ugly before she killed them or stuff like that. And that's where it came from here because the they were calling her a monster like nothing can come from like when she, they saw the scales on her face and all that kind of stuff that's where that came from and I'm glad that I got a an answer to that and she came upon um, Zeref Zeref turned her like her appearance into human but she couldn't taste anything she couldn't like do human stuff feel human stuff and then she was remember she remembered that uh she was she was pregnant with elsa and that she tried to enchant herself to the baby and i'm like what are we gonna have like a situation where natsu the natsu and zera situation where if natsu dies then zeref dies that's what i thought it was gonna go but then they said that it didn't work so i'm glad that didn't work and uh yeah and i'm glad that erza wasn't that affected by her story about her being abandoned by her mother and because because that happened she was able to find fairy tale and all the members and the master and just find a new family that's why you know you, sh you should like you should lament a, tra a tragedy but there's a good that comes out of it even if you don't know when or where that good is gonna come like there's always something coming out of the tragedy and i love that with her story her backstory with her mother abandoning her in the village and all that she went through and then she found fairy tale and now she's happy with her members and now that that happened like there's no love loss between irene and um erza so now they're gonna fight but the thing is irene is super strong so is Elsa gonna be able to defeat her well she has wendy with her but are they both gonna be able to defeat her like i don't know and then she called herself the mother of all dragon slayers and i'm like just go away and then i think when i was watching it she showed her hand and her hand was sort of like um dragony so <laughs> dragon like she had like sort of like talons or whatever so can she like transform into a dragon a will or is the spell that zf put on her is like permanent like she's a dragon inside but um with a human appearance like um Aknologia. although Aknologia, i feel like he can go back to being the dragon if you wanted to and there was a moment where i thought that technologia might be Elsa's uh, father just because they kind of look similar and but yeah that didn't happen this i particularly love this episode because i love the backstory that they gave and uh although my brother was like hey there's no fighting i don't care i loved it thank you guys for watching and i will see you next time bye